Hello everyone. In the video, we are going to cover 5 best affordable manual coffee grinder in the market, which are the best for you considering some unavoidable factors that you might miss out without watching this video. Here, we are going to give you an impartial review to help you out to find the best from a plenty of irrelevant products. For more info and updated pricing of the products mentioned in the video make sure to check the links in the description below. Let's start. Number 1. Our best pick is Java Price a manual coffee grinder. This hand grinder is a great mid-range option. Unlike some grinders, it lives up to its boasted versatility, grinding consistently well for all brewing types with its ceramic conical burr. Under 300 grams, the Java Presa is petite enough to flip into a suitcase or even a hiking bag. Its capacity is likewise limited, holding around 25 grams of grounds, but it's more than suitable as a travel grinder. The biggest drawback to this hand grinder is the amount of work required to grind finer particles. It may take over a couple of minutes to make ultra-fine espresso grounds and it's still not great in terms of uniformity. However, what you lose in efficiency, you retain in basic abilities. It isn't confusing to operate or dial in, it can perform any task, if perhaps more slowly, and is not so poorly made that it will fall apart in months. As long as you don't want to brew large batches of drip or percolated coffee, this grinder is reliable and functional. It's a great grinder for those who only make coffee at home once or twice a week or a steady travel option for the more experienced home brewer. Number 2. Our second best pick is Herio's Curtain Pro Ceramic Manual Coffee Grinder. This is a bit of a mixed bag, though still worth considering. On the plus side, the quality of this little hand grinder is surprisingly high. The conical burrs are ceramic, the ground coffee cache is glass, and the handle is stainless steel, with a comfortable grip knob. The ceramic burrs in this conical shape increase the power and fineness of the grind, but ultimately, the Hario Skirton Pro is still not the most consistent, especially if you're making something with coarser grounds. Although there are multiple grind settings, they are unlabeled. That isn't a big deal if you make your coffee the same way most of the time, but if you want a Chemex today and an AeroPress tomorrow, that can be an annoying adjustment. This manual coffee grinder can easily travel due to its small size. Its ground capacity is also not massive, 100 grams, but this may not be an issue for those making true espresso or other individual small cups throughout the day. You certainly won't waste many unused grounds. The silicone lid is non-slip, making it easier to use. The round, squat shape could also be a major plus for those who struggle to grip traditional hand grinders which come in a long, skinny cylinder. If your wrists and hands ache easily, the Herios curtain could be the ergonomic solution you are looking for. That would undoubtedly outweigh many CONS. In all, it is a worthwhile option for anyone who isn't trying to batch brew coffee. Its portability, shape, and decent grind consistency make it a great first manual grinder. If you like waking up to this every morning but need a little more power and control, you can upgrade later when you know precisely what you're looking for. This Hario can transition into your travel backup. Number 3. Our third best pick is One Espresso JX Pro Manual Coffee Grinder. This is another high powered, top notch grinder. Offering even more precision of grind size than the K Max, the J Max has the same 90 clicks per rotation in 9 grind settings, but with click sizes coming more often, at 8.8 .8 microns rather than 12.5. These smaller click sizes mean changes in the grind are even more subtle. Anyone who enjoys painstakingly finding the right number of clicks for the ideal grind setting to brew delicious coffee with no equal will surely appreciate this precision. The larger burrs are titanium coated, making them extra durable. They're capable of achieving a fine, consistent grind ideal for espresso. However, you can undoubtedly make any coffee you desire with this coffee hand grinder. The biggest downside to this one is that the finer grounds tend to stick to the inner walls. This hand grinder should be cleaned more often, it may be worth a quick clean after every use. That's not a lot of fuss if you're diligent about it, but it might be a waste of specialty coffee when you add up all the lost grounds. And yes, this model and K-Max are similar hand grinders. The biggest difference is the even greater precision offered by the J-Max otherwise, the grind settings, general build, and performance are about the same. While the J-Max also boasts those titanium-coated burrs, this likely won't make a big difference for most of us at the end of the day. It is an excellent manual grinder for any coffee drinker. But there's not much reason to choose it over the K-Max except for being cheaper. 
Number 4. Our fourth best pick is Time or Chestnut C2 Manual Coffee Grinder. Many manual grinders on this list are geared toward espresso makers, but not this one. It seems to be made for daily French press and pour over drinkers. The coarser to medium side of the grind spectrum will have the best luck with this manual grinder. If you stick to this range, the grind consistency is great for most home brewers. But yes, you can also take this Time War grinder on vacation. It weighs only 430 grams and is under 20 centimeters long. Although the ground capacity is on the smaller side, it's worth it for a travel ready model. As long as you don't mind grinding less at once and aren't looking for the espresso ready grinder of your dreams, it is a decent first manual coffee grinder. And if you're on the underserved coarser grind side of the spectrum, this is an excellent starter hand grinder. Number 5. Our fifth best pick is one Espresso Q2S manual coffee grinder. Mini is definitely the word for this grinder. It's only 16 centimeters long and weighs just under 500 grams, great for anyone who travels for a living or who really values having fresh coffee on trips. The next best word to associate with the Q2 is AeroPress. Its 20 gram capacity won't please everyone, but it's perfect for fans of this espresso like Quick Brewer. However, daily espresso drinkers will want to pass. This mini boasts nine dial positions but not a single grind setting. It may take a few tries to perfect a finer grind. As long as you don't plan to travel with a Bialetti 4 cup, this travel size still packs a fair punch. For convenience and improved coffee away from home, it yields a consistent particle size. The stainless steel burr is durable and a nice touch for a travel and budget option. The outer shell is aluminum and can weather a little jostling. That's good news if your suitcase might be thrown onto a plane twice a week. Overall, this grinder takes a little work to adjust to, thanks to its dial settings and limitations, but for many travelers, this mini manual coffee grinder is well worth considering. Most coffee drinkers on the go can enjoy it. Make sure to check the links in the description below. That's all for this review. Feel free to share your feedback.